<laughs> so we're gonna go down this tour. We're gonna take two bikes. Yeah. It's me and you. All right, come on, come on. And we're just gonna cross through here. So today we are announcing our Southside expansion for our e-scooter program. Uh, upon going to city council, our office was intending just to expand the operating hours for e-scooters. Right now they're from 5 a.m. to 9 p.m. Our office would like to change that into 1 a.m. just to make it easier for people getting off on of late shifts, getting off from of late classes to be able to get home safely and quickly. Uh, Councilman Jones suggested uh, upon looking at our current map of our e-scooter uh, nodes saying that uh, there isn't enough Southside representation. And then with us being the Office of Equitable Transit and Mobility, uh, increasing uh, mobility and transportation to the south side of the city is in the name of equity, we believe. So we would like to thank Councilman Jones for his suggestions and um, we'd like to see the implementation now. All right, all right. That's awesome, that was fun. I'm glad that we're here today to deal with mo you know, mobility on uh, uh, on, in South Richmond, right here on Warwick Road. And I think that is so important. We deserve the opportunity to one, bike safely, to walk safely, and then for a company like Bird to have their scooters here, we deserve that type of access. We're not gonna rip them up any more than they're gonna get ripped up anywhere else in any urban center, but we need that access. South Richmond, the number one uh, 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 transportation for so many people, or bicycles. That's the first thing we learn to do after we walk. We learn to ride a bike. And so, and actually I just bought my first bike, or, you know, just recently, just on yesterday. And took it out for a spin, rode it down here today. I was multimodal to a multimodal event. We want to be able to bike. We want to be able to take the bus. We want to be able to use every form of transportation that other cities have at their disposal. So we have two uh, e-scooter providers, Bird and Lime, and they each have permits for 500 devices uh, a piece. And out of those 500 devices, they are both dedicated 100 devices each to the south side of the city, and they have to remain at that 100 device mark south of the river. Our bike share system alongside the e-scooters are, are also expanding south side. So we have our first bike share system of South Side of the River here at Broad Rock Library, and we chose this location because you have bike lanes going down. It's a really good connection north-south, and you have a large uh, population coming to the libraries. It's a really good place to meet up and ride a bike somewhere. 